Hello everyone, I'm Drupal Mittal, campus uh, ambassador and organizer of Reality Hack 21 in collaboration with Reskill and Smart AR by Meta. Today, I'm going to guide you all through the necessary steps that you need to follow in order to make an AR effect and submit your idea in Reality Hack. So firstly, you should all have uh, AR Studio, Spark AR Studio installed on your systems. Uh, link for the same uh, is just given in the description below. So without any further ado, let's get started. Here you can see uh, right on uh, my screen, here's the first window that comes up when you open Spark AR Studio. There are a few predefined templates that you can use as a beginner to start with for making your first year effects. Um, I'll be just using a simple background filter over here. I'll just use this template. Yeah, so uh, this, is, uh, this is the window that comes up when you just choose a template and this is a stimulator that, that will be uh, displayed right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a simple background. I am going to delete this one, uh, which is predefined. So it's nothing here. I'm going to add an asset. And I am going to just add a simple texture uh, and import it from uh, my local system. So I've saved a few here. I'll be using this one, say. So yeah. The texture uh, has been uploaded here. It's just getting compressed. As you can see uh, on my screen, it's getting compressed here. Uh, for the background, we can just move to the materials. And here, right in the properties, we can choose this texture as background to get this effect. Uh, you can make a few changes. I'm just going to make it simple. Uh, since we are uh, we the main motto behind the video is to get you guys uh, you know just give a demo of how to publish an AR effect and how to make a submission basically so in the meanwhile as it is getting you know compressed i'll just add a text over here say i'll write merry christmas So you can place this text. This is 3D text that I'm using here. When I click on this, I can just move it anywhere I wish like. So I am say placing it right here. Okay. And I am gonna change the material here. Oh, it's using material zero, so I can change the color here. I can use any. Okay. So I'm playing a little over here, but yeah, so I'm just gonna keep it simple. Just Merry Christmas and a simple background here. Now, uh, the main thing, what, are, what we are gonna do is just publish this effect. So uh, right at the bottom uh, right corner of my screen, you can see a publish button and you can get this also from the file section here, publish. So we'll click on publish and there are uh, two things that we can do if you are uh, submitting your uh, submitting a new effect. So you have to click on publish a new effect or maybe you can use just you can uh, update an existing effect. So I am going to publish a new effect here. This is the demo video section. Uh, this is optional, but you can record the demo video from here and uh, save, save that in uh, .mp4 format and use it when you are uh, publishing the effect on Spark uh, AR Hub, I'll just move uh, to that part uh, in just a few minutes. So it is done, it is being compressed, the file size is fine, all of it is fine. So I'll. Uh, there are basically two ways, either I'll be uploading it, if I'll upload it, I'll be redirected to the Spark AR 
uh, hub in the browser window or what I can do is just export this project file. So I am gonna export this project file say Christmas background maybe. Yeah, so this file has been uh, exported. Now I'm gonna move to the Spark AR hub. Uh, the link for the Spark AR hub uh, will also be there in the description below. So I'm gonna publish this effect right here. Click on the publish effect button. I'll give a, it a name Christmas demo. Here you have to upload your project file if you're gonna just directly upload it via the upload button there it will uh, directly be imported here but you can do that explicitly as well like i did so we can publish it on all the platforms messenger instagram facebook all of it or we can choose specific platforms uh, i am gonna just publish it on facebook maybe and messenger so yeah uh, here what I have to do is I have to select certain categories, say selfies, appearance, sci-fi, any, any, you can choose according to the filter that you have made. You can select certain keywords so that it appears in the searches. That is uh, all up to you. Uh, here, like I told, you can record a demo video and upload a file here. So you have to choose file and upload this file here in the demo video section. In the upload image section, it is basically the thumbnail that will appear uh, when uh, when a, some uh, person is using your effect. So the thumbnail image is basically the icon. So that is it. But if you want to publish it, say privately, so on only on Facebook. So I'll select a link only button here and I don't have to specifically then include a demo video but yeah of course I can uh, include uh, an icon here I'll do that yeah, so I'm choosing any image right here yeah so yeah you can see that this is the thumbnail icon that will come up when you choose the icon so yeah we are good to go to publish this effect Okay, I can choose another one. I am gonna publish it now. Uh, it may take a few seconds depending on, uh, you know, the file size for uh, the project file that you have uploaded. So once it uh, gets uploaded, you'll be redirected uh, to the dashboard again. So the effect has been published. You have published your first year effect. Yeah, so here, so here what you can see is this window, which has all of these things. And now we are gonna move to the second half of uh, of the uh, video where I'm gonna just tell you about how to submit your uh, idea, submit your effect basically uh, for Reality Hack 21 for the hackathon. So what you're gonna need are two things. First is the uh, effect ID. You'll get the effect ID when you'll click on these three dots here and when you'll click on a copy effect ID, this is the Spark AR effect, Spark AR effect ID that I'm talking about. So okay, you can just copy it from here. From uh, test on device section, you can get a, a Spark AR effect link, which you can use and just test it on your local devices. On the same link can be uh, obtained from this share button here. So this is the same. Now I'll just move on uh, to the Reality Hack portal. Here you can see this is the portal we have. And uh, I have to just click on register now. Since I'm already registered, I am uh, redirected to uh, the, uh, the signed up dashboard here. So I'll uh, submit an idea, I'll edit an idea or maybe submit a new one since I'm already uh, using this. I have made an effect on Christmas. I'll se select the challenge for Christmas. I'll fill in the details 
then I'll move on to adding uh, effect link. I've already copied down, so that is there. I can get the effect link from here, as you can see. I'll paste it here. From three dots here, I'll just copy the effect ID and I'll paste the effect ID here. So here we can just upload a screenshot of uh, the effect that we have made. Uh, you can upload it via the simulator, the image, or you can just test it on your device, take an image and upload it here. So that is it uh, that you need to submit an idea. And yeah, you can submit an idea from here. So yeah. Uh, and here you can see that your idea has been submitted successfully. So this is it that you have to do for, uh, you know, uh, counting it as a valid submission. And there are, uh, there were a few doubts. There won't be any mail that you'll get uh, just after you'll be submitting an idea. But yeah, when, uh, when we'll be evaluating your uh, effects and uh, whoever will be finalized for the final pitch, they'll be receiving the mails. But although uh, all the participants that who submit a who submit an idea will be eligible for a backpack and a certificate definitely, so that is there. Yeah, I hope I have covered both the things and it's uh, pretty clear. I'll uh, reiterate once again on the effect ID and effect link. From here you'll get the effect ID, and from here you will get the effect link. That both of the things that you have to use in the submit idea section so yeah that is all you have to do all the best guys thank you so much